France crashed to a 2 0 defeat away to Denmark and Jules. Had Austria not lost at home to Croatia, you would have been relegated yeah, in the nation. Know. Yeah, but we're not. Yeah, but you would have been. I know, but you'd be like have, with some ifs, as you always say, you know, your nan would have wins or whatever. <laughs> What's the issue here? Don't, don't say know. the injuries because you told me, oh, they have two teams, they have three teams, they have four yeah, teams. Yeah, this was France's C team, but I mean. <sighs> A C team with Mbappe. I don't even know where to start. Yeah, I know. Mbappe and Griezmann, Chouamini and all of that. I think Deschamps made a mistake by having such a, such a young back three. Saliba, 21. Upamecano, 23. Badiashil, 21. I think all three of them is like nine caps. Uh, to play against a team like Denmark. Ooh, the, the threat of Casper no, 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 Dolberg. It's not, so much, it's not so much the threat of Dolberg or Damsgaard. The Danish Ibrahimovic. Skovolson. It's just, it's just the, I think, the... It's just the way the game would go, the intensity of the game. I don't think they were ready for it. And there's that patch 25 minutes in the first half where I think France started well and then we disappeared. We could not get three passes together. We could not get out of our own half. They pressed well. They scored the first goal. Then they were really a threat on set pieces by doing the same thing. They used to, they, they were blocking Chouameni and then Delaney was on his own to do a free header. That's how they scored the second one, two goals in five minutes. And that was it. It was poor from Deschamps. Second half was a bit better, and Mbappe missed two big, big chances. So it's not all bad, but it's just one of those games where you can't repeat it too many times. Otherwise, yeah. we're not going to see this France at the World Cup. No, definitely not. Well, thank you very much for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming, premium content, and let's not forget as well, ESPN FC, seven days a week. Subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.